You know, this is just a really cute area. I might just build a house again. We are starting UHC. Okay, guys. <laughs> Welcome to UHC. Oh, God. Yes. Oh, my God. This is GG. You did it, dude. be going in we're all on our own this is the biggest uhc we've ever had i believe we have 40 different people here people from all other different communities of the youtube coming together it's gonna be awesome it's gonna be this big event and the winner takes all so let's see who's gonna die first because someone one of you is gonna die first one of you is gonna be the meme of the season so we shall see that. anyways we're gonna get started here i'll start the game and we'll get right into it have fun everybody all right let's go, so guys, welcome to the UHC. This is the Cube UHC. If you're a long time fan of the channel, I was actually in the Cube UHC season 19, the last one, and I came second. I expect to do nowhere near as good because there's so many people. There's almost, I think, around 40 people. As you can tell, I'm stood next to Megan and Joy here. Bees there, Parker, Stacy. I, I think that might be Megan. No, that's not Megan. I don't know where Megan is. She's in here somewhere. Page Bomb, Grazer, King Tong. They're all in here, so it's gonna be fun. Okay, we're, we're getting ready to fall to our deaths. I'm <laughs> getting so nervous for these things, even though I don't care. <laughs> okay, here we are. This is our little area. Looks pretty nice. I see a ravine over there, so we'll sort of head that a direction and grab some trees along the way. Okay, we're gonna grab some wood, we're gonna do the usual, and we're gonna go over to that ravine. Now I think the first episode does have truce, like you can't kill anyone in the first episode. So I've got 15 minutes to make the most of that time. I'm hoping it will end well. <laughs> now my goal for this is basically not die first and anything else on top of that is just a bonus. I don't have high expectations for myself. Right, here's the ravine. Okay. Now I do have shaders on. I'm trying to make it pretty for you all. That might change as we get into the game. If I end up down in a cave or something and cannot see. That's when I'll maybe have to, you know, turn it off. But at the moment, we're going to try and make it pretty. And someone died already. They're dead already. It's been like one minute. I'm dead. Well, I'm not actually dead. They're dead. Zine's dead. Holy heck. Okay, we're gonna jump up to the surface. We're gonna make ourselves some wooden tools. And then we're gonna go back down. Now, my goal is to try and make sure I just kind of waffle for a little bit more than I did last time we did, like, the Harmony Hall UHC. Because I'm really bad at talking. I like to edit things down. But it means then when it comes to the videos, they're always super short because we only have 15 minutes of filming and I don't talk for a lot of it. So I'm going to do my best to just talk about everything and anything as this goes on. And one thing I can talk about is this is actually the 10th anniversary of Minecraft. That's one of the reasons this kind of came together. 
and why we're uploading it when we are. It is the 10th anniversary, which is insane. Minecraft has been around for 10 years. I'm shook. Now also, where was that tree? Oh, this was the tree I destroyed. Really? There's been no apples? You're gonna do me dirty like that game? If everyone on here, I'm one of the people that still uploads Minecraft and you're gonna do me dirty like that? Okay. I'll kill these pigs. Get some food. Oh, there's some cows, which means I can get some books. I need some sugar cane as well, just in case I can somehow get an enchanting table. Now, I also could do with these trees decaying a little bit. I don't need many apples because last time I played a UHC, I got tons of apples and then just didn't have any way to get anything from them or like I didn't have gold. So I couldn't actually make anything with it. Right, let's head down into the mine to grab some iron and such. I'm gonna make that into a bunch of wood and then we'll be good to go. Now I see a tiny little bit of iron. It was one piece. Are you freaking kidding? What the ink? Why was it one piece? Why did I? I also can't see very well because shaders. Do not betray me like this. I was trying to make it pretty. Oh, hi. I can't really see you. I can just see some water particles. You know, I'm just gonna mine this. If I break that, there we go. Hello. Goodbye. Okay, there's a little bit of coal here. This is genuinely the worst ravine I've ever seen in my life. I've got absolutely nothing from that. I've had like three bits of coal and like two bits of iron. I'm actually shook. I don't understand. And no apples. None, really. Wait, what did I get? An apple! I have one apple. I would like more. <gasps> There's one. Okay. Yeah, I think there was another ravine over this way. So I want to head over there because, no, did I say a strip mine? I meant a ravine. Mm -hmm. Or I might have said ravine the first time and I was completely correct, but I want to head over here. Okay, no, this is not a ravine. I don't know where the ravine was. I'm just sure that there was one. Okay, so Shelby's on, does that mean Shelby's on three hearts? I think it means Shelby's on three hearts. Oh, there's some sugar cane over there. Okay, 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 okay. This could be good. This will get me paper. So then if I find diamonds, I can make an enchant table. I also think I see a village. Oh, there's a village. I don't know if that's a necessarily amazing thing. I just always get excited about villages for some reason. But there's enough sugar cane here. You know, this is just a really cute area. I might just build a house again. I'll play normally for a little bit like longer and then I'll decide if I'm gonna build a house or not. But like this area is cute. I can grab a lot of food from here, which is nice. You know, grab all the carrots and all of the potatoes. So I don't need to worry about food. I'm gonna to need to murder horses. So we're just gonna cut this bit out. I needed to murder it for the leather. I'm so sorry. Murdering horses is awful. <laughs> It's the one Minecraft mob that when you kill, you feel bad for. There's a bunch of sugar cane here, but it's super small and it's really annoying. Okay, I've got some leather. I'm gonna grab a little bit more sugar cane. And then I might just need to try and find like a cave. Oh, and there's some cows. They've just spawned in, which is great. Both for more leather and for food. And how deep is this little ravine? Okay, it's not too bad, but like, it does have some coal. I've just fallen, taken half a heart because I misjumped one block. I'm so mad at myself. I did this last time. I can't believe I've taken half a heart. Look at it, I've been ruined. I'm now no longer solid 10. Ah, I'm 9.5. I'm so mad. Okay, we're gonna just dig up. The sun setting. Yes, it is. Okay. Did maybe find a cave. There's one over here, I think, that I should go down into. This. But I'm just gonna make a bunch more sticks into torches. And then we're gonna we're gonna go in. Look at me using torches so that the game still looks pretty for you all. I'm really out here doing the most. Okay, I hear a zombie. Please don't come for me. Okay, we've got some more iron. Okay, that area looks scary, so we're gonna go the other way first. We'll grab this coal. 
And you know what? I think whilst I grab this coal, I will make myself a furnace and start smelting my iron. Just to, you know, maximize efficiency, make sure I'm doing the utmost I can. Now, other than that, like, original zombie I seen, and then hearing one, I've actually been okay so far. Skeletons are what I'm scared of because there's no shields. You'll also get to see my concentration face in battle because whenever I'm fighting things, I'm normally just like, <laughs> so you'll get to see that. Lucky you. I wish we had vein miner or something just for these large bits of coal. I'm gonna to need to make sure I have so much coal solely for the fact that I'm going to be having to make lots of torches. Oh, more iron. This was a good little coal vein. I was just mining away and then more iron was just hiding. Okay, let's go back and check our furnace, smelt that, and then we'll make ourselves some armor, I think. And then we'll do a sword and a pickaxe. So we've got a chest plate. I'm gonna just throw away some extra things that I don't need. Cause like, I don't need a peony or some seeds. I'll keep my apples, my sugar cane, the chicken, feathers. Don't need the stone pick or the stone sword because I have these now. I think I'll maybe try and keep like blocks on one side and everything else on the other. Look at me being like smart with how I do this this time. You guys should be so proud of me. And then I could also probably do with grabbing a little bit more stone just to make another furnace because we've only got another minute left of this episode and then people can murder me. So that's great. Okay, we're gonna put in some potatoes. Holy Jesus, potatoes are quick. Oh, wait, does everything cook that quick? Everything cooks that quick. I didn't know. I'm actually shook because last time I just dumped it and left. I didn't realize it was doing it that quick. Holy heck. So I didn't need two furnaces. I actually wasn't any faster. Love that for me. Okay, we have full iron. We have quite a bit of food. We're going to keep adventuring. That leads to the surface world. We don't like that. That's spooky. How much coal do I have? 37. That should be enough for a while. That leads nowhere. Right. We're doing this, guys. And turns out episodes are 20 minutes long, not 15. So we still have another five minutes. Okay, what's up here? Nothing. Great. I'll grab another tiny little bit of coal. I don't want my inventory to just be full of it. We were talking about the border. And I don't know... Where I am. I'm at 500 and like 1,000. I think the border's like 4,000 something. So I'll be fine for a while. You know, I should actually... You don't even need coal for it. That's insane. I'm going to make a bucket because if I can find myself some water, I can then, if I find lava, make obsidian to A, make it easier just to traverse around. But also then if I find some diamonds, I can get some obsidian to then go to the nether. Because yeah, I'm totally doing that. I'm just having to throw down every torch possible. This cave is so big. Jesus, it goes on forever. Oh, but there's some water. Where is your source block? Hello? Oh, there's some more iron. I just like grabbing it all just in case I happen to like break my pickaxe or something. Where did you come from? Oh wait, it comes from so far away. I thought this was just gonna be a nice little like easy to find stream. Turns out I think it's actually attached to the surface. It is. Right, well I've grabbed a bucket of water and now I can go back down where I came from. Okay, I need to actually make it over to this. Cause I don't wanna go down there just yet. I need to make more torches again. There is a lot of lava. Okay, we should make our way down. Is that wood? Does that mean there's a mine shaft? I don't want to lose this water. Oh god, that was terrifying. Oh god, this is also terrifying. I don't like the fact that it's a mine shaft. Like, part of me is like, wow, that's great. I've been so lucky. The other part of me is like, I'm going to die with things like that. Oh, hello, Mr. Skeleton. Not skeleton, zombie. I just am here for the string, honestly. So if you could leave me be, that would be fantastic. If I hear a spider spawner, I'm out of there. You know, like some things just aren't worth it. And the grace period has ended. So with that, I hope you enjoyed episode one. If you did, remember to leave a like. Comment down below how far you think I'm going to manage in this. Do you think I'll make it to the end? Do you think I'm gonna die in like a gravel fall? Subscribe if you're new to the channel, hit the notification bell so you do not miss a video, and I will see you all next time. Bye.